friends my name is hari nandan and you're watching of and halix telecom channel friends today we will discuss about bswl bswr and rsi so what is bswr and what is rsi and how comes bswr and how comes rsi so this thing we have to know okay but before knowing this thing so i have to start from beginning and we have to know first what is the configuration of bts okay because if we if we will see then there is two type configuration okay first type your rf module and your bts rf module plus your bts okay and second is your there is no rf module okay there is no rf module your only bts is there and and bts will be connected through feeder cable to gsm dia so that is different configuration and that is different configuration okay so this thing we have to know and we will know about connectivity and how connecting okay see we will discuss about first configuration first what we have first configuration we have our gsm antenna connecting to radio okay through jumper cable and our radio connecting to bts through optical or cpu cable okay so rsi where is issue bswr where will be issue okay so we are getting this type alarm from jumper cable or feeder cable okay so so the first one is there is no feeder cable okay so forget it okay so we will know about this ki our gsm antenna connecting to rh through jumper cable if your jumper cable is damaged or your jumper cable is loose it's not connected proper to gsm antenna ya to radio so then it will create rssi but your jumper is damaged or your jumper jumper rf jumper having water then it will create bswr bswr means voltage ascending wave ratio okay voltage ascending wave ratio if your gsm uh, gsm antenna receiving power through jumper rf jumper uh, from radio module so if any water seepage there your uh, your rf rf jumper cable is damaged then gsm antenna will not receive proper power then it will create bsw bswr that is voltage ascending wave ratio okay if minor is there if your jumper cable is loose connected to gsm antenna or your radio then it will create rssi and rssi value when we are getting rssi alarm in bts then our our rsi difference is more than 6 above 5 sorry below 5 you will not get rsi but above 5 you will get rsi okay and above 10 15 then you will get bswr okay so this thing happening in first configuration and second configuration and how is the connectivity for second configuration second conf conf uh, uh, second configuration connectivity is our gsm antenna okay our G gsm antenna connecting through feeder cable to bts G gsm antenna to feeder feeder to suggester suggester to jumper jumper to our duplexer yeah sometime also we are using rf jumper on top also okay so this type configuration is there okay so now we will check where is our connectivity first connectivity is there our coaxial cable connected to g17 that is fast first connectivity okay that is first connectivity so there also we will get issue okay if there is not connected proper then it will create rsi rsi mean receive a strength signal indicator i mean our g17 is not receiving proper power okay some issue is happening there due to uh, some damage or loose connection whatever thing 
okay so first connectivity is there and second connectivity your feeder cable connected to your surge arrestor okay so there that place also you have to check okay loose should be not there if loose is there then it will create rsi and bsw also and third our jumper cable connecting to surge arrestor from duplexer that is third connectivity okay so this connectivity also we need to check either it is connected proper or not and fourth our our jumper rf jumper connecting to duplexer so in that place also we need to check it is connected or proper or not and last we need to check hardware if your hardware is faulty okay internally faulty there okay and you not getting any hardware alarm you will not get i know that okay it will report only bswr and rs so so that time you have to replace hardware if if you not replace hardware then alarm will not clear okay make sure that so you have to replace hardware so this time configuration is there and we are checking this configuration then we can clear bswr and rsi and one thing i'll tell you if bswr is coming in your bts then your duplexer and your trx okay duplexer and trx you will see their red light okay hardware your hardware will blink in red light okay and if rs is there okay so it will uh, it will blink only yellow, yellow light sometimes is happening it will also in rsi is there that time also it will blink in red light but that time you need to you need to check hardware first okay so this thing for alarm clearance bwr and rsi in telecom sector okay so this thing those and i hope you enjoying watching my video and and if you are new then please subscribe my channel and also you can press bell icon and thank you those